It's time for this week's edition of Uniquely Utah. From the wild west of the past to the modern fashion of today, the look of a cowboy is unmistakable. But what you might not know is there is a store in central Utah that's played a big role in shaping the look of modern western fashion, thanks to its many contributions to popular culture. Fox 13 News reporter Spencer Joseph got a first-hand look at their booming operations thanks to a very popular TV show. In the small town of Salina, Utah, sits a shop which has stood the test of time. So Utah has been an amazing place to have our operation. All of us have some point in our lineage when our ancestors set out and seeking a better life. I think that's why so many people are attached to the cowboy or western lifestyle. It was a short period in time, but that's really what it embodies, is striking out on your own, trying to make your life better for you and for your posterity. And that western start is how Burns Saddlery came to be. We have a great family story, and it's a story of entrepreneurship. Starting in 1876 with Miles Burns, the business has transformed from blacksmiths to horse-drawn carriages and saddles to inventing car seat covers and now creating luxury western wear. The business has always pivoted. I think that's one key thing that we've learned from our progenitors, and we've just been able to keep evolving and moving forward. This is Braden Shaw, the sixth generation of Burns to run what is now the oldest family-owned Western shop in America. So I can shape that one up for you. And like those before him that have all brought a unique twist to the company, this <laughs> is his passion. But hats are just the start of what they do. We have a hundred and five employees here in a little small community, 60 some craftsmen building handmade products from custom boots and saddles, belt buckles, hats. Anything that's handmade and, and got heart and soul into it can, can really make that product better. This is Matthew so, Warner. He's put the insole on the last. Well, I, I uh, actually am a saddle maker by trade started about 15 years ago in the saddle making. Now as president of production, his job right is to oversee quality. The process we have here, it's all still made by hand. Functional art is what we build. So that's something that's very much functional and used in the elements from the cowboy hat to the saddle. It's, it's something that can be used and abused but still last a lifetime. They're building heirloom quality products. That's one thing we all care about in this in this room, making sure we're doing high quality, the best work we can, and the craftsmanship is, is constantly moving forward. And dedication to craft has grown their business from a tiny shop to now having retail spaces in other states and shipping around the country and the world. But it was their Park City store that created an opportunity that no one saw coming. All circumstance that they were filming in Park City, walked into our Park City store, the costume designer, and says, hey, we're filming this project, Yellowstone. I thought it was a documentary, right? So <laughs> we didn't know the premise, um, and they are looking for this product, and we were able to fit the cast. There's no question, Utahns love the show Yellowstone and with it, the fashion of the characters. It's really rewarding to see your product on the silver screen. Hey, Matt built that product, or Jose engraved this buckle, and it's really cool to see that, and I think our craftsmen really appreciate that as well, and it really uplifts them, that it's like, hey, I did that. It's a partnership that's continued till today. When they moved the, the filming to Montana, um, we got less of the we need a quick product, but we're still doing those iconic pieces for season five that's just out. This is actually the John Dutton season five, so the black hat that he wears there. And with the show's popularity comes orders. Lots and lots of them. We say that Kevin Costner's been our number one salesperson for the last four years. We ship Yellowstone hats and belts and buckles all over the world. Uh, so it's been great for business and the industry in whole. Pretty much everything from the show they make, you can buy. Uh, hats, for sure, are the most recognizable and iconic pieces on the show. So the John Dutton hat, the Beth hat, you know, they're the things that are most requested and that we sell the most of. You know, the belts and the buckles are cool and we sell them. And 
boots are a little more unique and individual depending on what style you want. So as the show heads into its fifth season. I think for the success that the show has, it's awesome to, that we have one small part in that. Yellowstone has brought a lot of light to the new age Western era. It's revitalized Western culture. And I do believe it's helped the saddle industry, the hat industry, boot industry, shafts, all that stuff. I think it's really brought to light how cool the Western heritage really is. And solidified a small shop. We're really fortunate to live in a small community of Salina. The big history into everyone's hearts and minds. And it lets you own a little piece of this shop story that's so uniquely Utah. It's an iconic part of America. Spencer Joseph, Fox 13 News. And that's what we keep alive. Utah.